on the installation instruction. Use a safety knife to cut through the cable jacket around the outer conductor, carefully peeling the jacketing while cutting. Next, snap the supplied saw guide into the valley of the second full corrugation from the end of the cable. Using a fine tooth hacksaw, cut the cable end flush with the saw guide. It is important a straight cut is made. Once the cut has been made, Use a flat file and knife tip to remove any sharp edges or copper particles from the inner and outer conductor. Such particles can cause unwanted RF reflections. Use a nylon brush to remove any copper shavings from the foam and inner conductor. Next, remove cable jacket per measurement specified on the installation instruction. Again, by carefully cutting and peeling off the jacket. Using the supplied foam separation tool, separate the foam from the outer conductor. Next, push the unthreaded end of the clamping body onto the cable, exposing one corrugation valley. Carefully guide the spring ring into the corrugation valley. Next, guide the connector body onto the clamping nut and tighten. While tightening, it will take approximately one complete rotation to fully tighten the connector. Once tight, visually inspect connector. No gap should be present between the clamping body and interface assembly.